the spring of 1961, the Congress of Racial Equality, or CORE, began the Freedom Rides, a biracial act of direct, non-violent action to desegregate the South by riding buses from Washington to New Orleans to test the legitimacy of the Morgan and Boynton decisions, which made it illegal under federal law to discriminate against interstate travelers. Young Riders tells the story of four young members of SNCC, the Student Nonviolent Coordinating Committee, who made the courageous and some say irresponsible decision to continue the Freedom Rides after the original riders were brutally attacked in Alabama, causing the organizers to cancel the remainder of the ride. We meet the four activists in a small apartment in Nashville as they celebrate a local victory desegregating movie theaters. After hearing of the attacks, they volunteer to restart the rides, which would almost guarantee violence upon them. Not everyone found the strength to go. Young Riders shines a light on a moment in the civil rights movement that started as a simple idea but ignited a national debate that rose to the heights of the federal government. The play also makes it painfully clear that the struggle for equality is constant by exposing the overlaps between them 